I asked Liv, did you enjoy it? And she said, yeah. She really did enjoy it. And the last thing I ever remember saying to her is, what was your favourite song that evening? And then it's just all blank. Olivia's just a bubbly child, cheeky, as cheeky as anything. Um, if you're feeling down, she'll make you laugh. If she can't make you laugh, she'll hug you until you're smiling again. Um, she's always there for everybody. Uh, no matter how she's feeling, she'll put everybody else first. Um, she, she's just adored by so many people that knew her. I remember Olivia as the cheeky, gobby little girl that she was, always singing, laughing, diving on my bed. Um, yeah, just the typical Olivia, really. She said, Mum, if I can make someone smile, then my day's happy. She was a nice girl, funny, kind, talented, beautiful, you know, all. All those characteristics that just make everything a bit more sad, you know, because you had the work, she had the world in her hands, and it just, it, it, she went, she, she was gone. Oh, I had so much to give. She had a whole life ahead of her. With her determination, she would have accomplished whatever she set out to achieve. She'd put 100% into anything, but she always did it with a smile on her face. She'd have made people laugh. She just wanted everyone to be happy. Ollie was a 15-year-old girl. She had her whole life ahead of her. She never, she got to meet her first nephew, Thomas, who was born just days before she died. But she never got to meet Piper Olivia. But Piper is a mini Olivia. Even her due date was the 22nd of May. Only had a thing about dinosaurs. She never really said, I love you to people. She told us that in dinosaur language, raw means I love you. So she would come up and just say, raw mum. And that was her way of saying that she loved me. The void in our lives is immense. And our lives have changed forever. I was proud to be her papa. Her grandma and I just wanted her grandchildren to grow up healthy and happy. We never thought we would be in this position. Oh, my princess, I miss you so much. You were special, or speckle as you would say. You know we love you so, I will simply say, raw, from women. I'm very grateful to Olivia's mother, Charlotte, for helping me and all of us get to know her daughter. This has been a very important process for me and for all of us involved with the inquiry. Neither Olivia nor any of those who died are or will be simply numbers to us. And with her determination and sense of humour, Olivia would have made a success of a life in music or in anything else she chose to do.